it's not like a lot of the the funkiness besides this isn't just hyperland like i'm going to talk about things in the context of using hyperland but not every issue i talk about is going to be hyperland specific one of those being the weird issue i had with my camera so this happens on sway as well i don't know if it's consistent on sway but I've certainly seen it reported on Sway. I think I've seen it reported on KDE as well. Um, so, okay. When I play a game like Final Fantasy XIV, this is a game that is very heavy on mouse usage. And for some weird reason, I'm not sure why, but if you click the mouse, it's not even moving it, right? Like, that would be one thing. If you moved it and something weird happened, whatever. But if you click the mouse, randomly it snaps your camera. So, like, you're staring right at the ground. Which, you know, if you're in, like, a fight, you're trying to navigate the map, do anything in the game, can be really, really annoying. And I didn't know what was happening. I'll see if I can find it. Uh, I think it was on, like, Reddit or something I saw it. Old dot Reddit. Maybe I'll find it then. Is it here? I don't know. It's not in my history anymore. Damn it. I probably won't be able to refind it. Wait. No. I found it. Yes. Okay. So, people reported the exact same problem here. This is the problem, where, like, you, you click, and then occasionally the camera just snaps. This happens in other games like Guild Wars 2 and other games that involve a lot of, uh, a lot of camera movement. I don't know why. I genuinely don't know why. No one knows why. It's been reported in various places, and it is just a problem. I think KDE still has the problem. Someone quote me on uh some correct me on that if i'm wrong but i'm pretty sure it does i tried a bunch of things to deal with it like running uh wine in its virtual desktop mode so it's not just like a, it's not just opening the application like it literally has a virtual windows desktop that you can like do windows desktopy things in um that didn't work <laughs> that didn't work at all the only thing that worked consistently for me is running game scope so game scope if you don't know game scope is a wayland compositor it's not like a a wayland compositor in the same sense as like hyperland or sway or anything like that what it is is a much simpler wayland compositor more akin to something like uh wayland jail or something there's this little application where you run a one program and nothing it and nothing else. This does basically the same thing. So this is a microcompositor, formerly known as Steam Comp MGR, and basically it runs. Th this is what most games on the Steam Deck are run as. So if you do like your your FSR injection, you do your your frame rate control, things like that. All of that is being controlled by game scope i think you can disable game scope if you want to but like i think it's a fault it just uses game scope for everything and it works like really well like really 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 well so running games in this just completely dealt with the problem i don't know what game scope is doing differently from sway and hyperland um but I'm, I, I do wish that someone would sort of explore that who understands the code and understands, like, what could possibly be causing it. Because if I didn't need to run Gamescoop, I, I wouldn't run Gamescoop. Like, I don't hate Gamescoop, right? But I don't like adding things just for the sake of fixing a problem. It's one thing to add Gamescoop because you want to force FSR. You want to you wanna force a frame rate. You want to... I don't know, uh, other things that it, this can do. Um, you want to limit a frame rate. You want to change a resolution. You want to force borderless or full screen. Things like this. Like, if that's what you want to do, fine. But when I run Gamescoop, 
I'll, I'll find the script, actually. I think the script I've just called FF14. Um, go, uh, no, go to my scripts folder. FF, XIV. Yeah, it's just called FF14. So the script is literally gamescope w 1920 dash h 1080 dash dash the name of the program so what i'm saying is run that uh, run a window that's 1920 by 1080 and run the program which is basically the same as saying run the program <laughs> i'm only specifying the the width and height just to make sure it doesn't like do wonky things and try to give me some random resolution that doesn't make any sense um so if i didn't need to run gamescope i wouldn't run gamescope from my experience, I've not seen any other games causing an issue. To be fair, I don't play that many games with a mouse anyway. Like, I'm playing DMC3 with controller. I played Hogwarts with a controller. I play uh, Yakuza with a controller. Most games I just play with a controller. So it's very possible if I play something like Path of Exile, for example... It could have issues. I've wanted to go back and play it. I'll have to go and experiment with that and just see what happens. I have a feeling it will happen um, because it does happen in multiple other games that are completely unrelated. It's not like it's an engine issue with running under X Whalen and running on Whale and things like that. It seems to just be a problem with how the mouse is handled on Whalen. Once again, not specifically Hyperland but a more general Wayland issue. Minus Gamescope, because they work something else.